Hey, let's talk about public dashboards, generally available in Grafana 10.2 on the 24th of October 2023. I'm Thanos and I'm a Senior Product Manager on the Dashboards team at Grafana Labs. What problem does public dashboard solve? We have been watching our community and customers asking for better ways to share insights with others without having to log into Grafana. For this reason, we have developed public dashboards in order to allow our users to share their visualizations and insights to a broader audience, including their peers and external users, without a requirement of a login. Users can effortlessly use our current sharing model and create a public dashboard URL to share with the world. So how does it work? Let me show you. You can see I'm on my personal dashboards folder that contains one dashboard. I'm going to click on it. I find this information here quite useful that I want to share with the rest of the people. I'm going to click the share dashboard CTA. And among the standard options that we already know, we have added a new one, which is a public dashboard option. So I'm going to click on it. At the time of this recording, public dashboards is under public preview. I want to gener generate a public dashboard URL. And in order to do this, I have to acknowledge these requirements. Some of those requirements are about acknowledging that the entire dashboard is going to be public. And currently, we do support a certain uh, set of data sources with uh, the aim to support additional ones along the way. Clicking these requirements, I can generate now a public dashboard URL. This is my dashboard URL, a public dashboard URL, which I'm just going to copy. Here you can see some additional um, settings. I find this uh, CTA quite useful, which is about posing a sharing dashboard. This, can be, this functionality can be quite handy because uh, you might have realized that you want to fix something in the dashboard and you don't want to communicate temporarily uh, this information. Additional settings are about um, setting the default time range and then showing annotations. I can also revoke the public URL. So I'm going to open a new tab and paste the public dashboard URL. The dashboard has been posted by the administrator, which I'm, I'm going to unpause and refresh the page. So here you can see my dashboard. We have added a label here next to the sharing CTA in order for you to know that this dashboard has been publicly shared. In addition, under the dashboard um, menu, you can click on the public dashboards and see which are the dashboards that have been shared with the people. This is quite, can be quite handy because you can have an overall view of all the dashboards that can, are being shared publicly. Um, here you can have some quick actions like delete, uh, configure a public dashboards, and go to that public dashboard, as well as pause sharing. Um, currently, I want to delete that public dashboard, which I'm going to revoke public URL. If you want to learn more about public dashboards, you can always visit our uh, documentation page um, where you can see how the feature can be enabled and how the settings can be set up, uh, along with the information about the supported data sources. Public dashboards is free to use and is available for both on-prem and cloud offerings. Uh, we are really excited about this feature and can't wait to see you using it as well as giving us feedback. Thank you.